I'm Greg DiBernardo, contributing editor for Tools of the Trade magazine here at JLC Live in Providence, Rhode Island. And I'm at the RotoZip booth, and I just saw a new tool that uh, Dan here is going to explain to us. It's pretty interesting. Dan, what can you tell us about the new tool? Sure. Good afternoon. I'm Dan Blythe. I'm a product manager uh, for the RotoZip brand, part of the Bosch Power Tool Group. Today, we're introducing the brand new RotoZip Roto Saw. It's a new entry level spiral saw, uh, so it's going to be great for um, the drywall installer, for general contractors, and also for do it yourselfers. Uh, some notes about this tool it's a 5.5 amp magnet core motor uh, that enables us to have a nice, compact, lightweight tool, so it's going to be very comfortable to use over extended periods of time. Uh, it runs at 30,000 RPM, so it uses all of the standard Rotozip bits and accessories. Uh, we have a new guide foot, so that's going to accept an available dust adapter, which I'll show in a little bit when we do some cutting, and also accepts the Rotozip circle cutter. Um, so we're very excited about this tool. It's going to be hitting retail stores starting in May. Uh, if you happen to be at JLC today, they're going to get a good deal. Uh, so, uh, Dan, what different types of material can, will this tool cut? This tool is going to cut most every common building material that you're going to come across. Of course, it's going to cut drywall, um, since that's what Rotozip is mainly known for. But it's also going to do a great job in plywood, laminate flooring, backer boards, uh, behind your tile. We have some great uh, accessories for granite tile, porcelain tile, and ceramics. So any building material you're going to come across or any hard material that you had to cut, uh, Rotozip is going to have a solution that's going to make a nice... Dan, is it going to cut metal, like ducts, things like that? It will cut metal. We have a very nice carbide metal cutting bit. Uh, that's great for doing HVAC and those type of applications. The one big thing for contractors is dust collection, and I know that this tool has built-in dust collection, so to speak. So uh, maybe we can take a whirl on some drywall and see how that's going to work. Sure, we'll just make a quick cut here. Uh, let me pop on my power strips. So we have the, uh, the simple snap-on adapter. And all we need to do is cut. So you can see that Adapter does a nice job of keeping all the dust intact. Uh, it works well with not only our drywall bits, but also our multi-purpose bits and other dust management bits. So it really helps if you're working in finished spaces uh, or even in a work site where you don't want to be spraying um, drywall dust. Those and does that come forward. with the tool itself or is it an accessory? This will be available as an accessory afterwards. It's going to be part of uh, our dust management kit that we have available in, in most retail locations. What are the typical bits cost for, for this tool? The typical bits will cost anywhere from $5 up to $20 depending on the t size of the bit and then the material that it's going to cut. Great. And this tool is out now or it's going to be released? This is a, a special sale here today. It'll be released starting in May of this year. So another month or so and we'll be rolling uh, in all the major home centers as well as online and uh, at your local right. retailers. What's your approximate street price for this tool? Uh, the suggested retail value is going to be uh, $69. So that'll come with two cutting bits as well as three collets. So you can use all of the Dremel accessories and not need to worry about searching around for collets for it. Uh, so we feel it's going to be a, a very nice tool for, you know, for the do with yourselfers, the general contractors, and even the production drywall guys. Great. Well, thanks for your time, Dan. It was interesting, and uh, we'll see you soon. Yep. Thank you.